this would be interesting for the Dallas Cowboys. The club was hoping it could retain wide receiver Cole Beasley for 2019 and beyond, but saw their three-year, $18 million offer blown out of the water by the Buffalo Bills, who landed the veteran on a four-year, $29 million deal with $14.5 million in guarantees. Team executive Stephen Jones floated the idea ahead of the loss that the team might look to Alan Hearns to fill the role going forward, but there are several issues surrounding that thought. The most prevailing is obvious, with Hearns having suffered a gruesome broken leg in January that ended his season. He making strides on the path to recovery, but it's a long and tough road to hoe. That's why the Cowboys are reportedly set to host Randall Cobb, the team announced, as they try to find a more definitive solution to the Beasley void. Cobb is a former second-round pick of the familiar Green Bay Packers who went on to land Pro Bowl honors in 2014. He played eight seasons in Wisconsin and finished his final contract in 2018, hitting the free agency market as the Packers opted to not re-sign him. Cobb would not only bring his veteran presence to the Cowboys but also an ability to flex from the slot to the outside, giving offensive coordinator Kellen Moore the ability to be more creative with his WR usage. He'll have to work to prove he's still an impactful target though, coming off of his worst season of production as a pro. In 2018, Cobb reeled in just 383 receiving yards and three touchdowns, and was hampered by a hamstring injury that cost him five games. He'd finish the year with nine games and six starts, but can still be a viable option if healthy. He'll be 29 years old when the 2019 season gets underway, the same age as Beasley, but is also just one season removed from a solid 653-yard, 4-TD campaign with the Packers. Cubs battles with the Cowboys as a player have been up and down, but more of the former, having a 2-1 record against Dallas in the regular season that includes 19 catches for 163 yards and a TD. He kicked things up a notch come playoff time, going 2-0 with the Packers in games the Cowboys would love to forget, with Cubs 15 receptions and 178 receiving yards helping to dismiss Dallas from the playoffs in two of the most notable games in recent NFL history. The first occurred at Green Bay, the scene of the infamous overturned catch on Des Bryant in January 2015, and the second come one year later at it. It'd be interesting, to say the least, if the Cowboys go on to sign Cobb, being slated to meet the Packers in the regular season to come, but first they have to be convinced he's durable and still has tread on his tires.